What is up guys and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak iOS 13.0 all the way up to iOS 13.4. Now a lot of y'all are coming from my TikTok and a lot of y'all don't know what the term jailbreaking means and jailbreaking means to just mod your iPhone and install cool tweaks and themes on your iPhone. But this works for iOS 13.0 all the way up to 13.4 as previously mentioned and I'm going to show you how to check what iOS version you're running. So you want to click on settings, go to general, about, and right there, software version 13.4. So that means I am good to go to jailbreak. For this video, this tutorial will only work on an iPhone 5S, iPhone 6, 6S, 6S Plus, 6 Plus, 7, 7 Plus, 8, 8 Plus, and the iPhone X. This does not work on any iPhone below the iPhone 5S or any iPhone above the iPhone X. So no, you cannot do this on your brand new iPhone 11, unfortunately. Now for this video, you will also need a Mac computer to be able to install CheckRain, which is a tool we are going to be using to jailbreak this iPhone. If you do not have a Mac computer, you can also use a Linux computer. Um, but if you're using a Linux computer, there's really no point in my tutorial because if you're if you're educated well enough to use a Linux computer, then you shouldn't really need my tutorial because jailbreaking is a walk in the park compared to installing Linux. But this is not available for Windows yet, unfortunately, so you will need a Mac computer. Alright guys, once you got your Mac, open up Safari and type in this web link. I'll put it on the screen right there. And it will take you to the Checkering website and you're going to click get the beta now. And right here, it should just say download for Mac OS. You don't want to click that. And the download will start. All right, guys, so once it installs, it will be right here in the downloads folder. So you want to click on it to open it. You can go ahead and exit out Safari now. And then you want to drag in your applications like that. And I already have my applications, so I'm not going to do that. So I'm just going to exit out. And once it's in your applications, you can go ahead and right click this, click eject. And then you're going to want to click go. You want to click applications and check in will be right there. And now is the part where you want to connect your iPhone. Once your iPhone is connected right here, you're going to want to click start and then click next and your iPhone should cut off and it should be being, it should be in the process of entering recovery mode. Once it's in recovery mode right here, it has some steps we're going to do. So if you're on an iPhone X, you're going to want to hold, I think it's like the side button and the volume down button together but every other and then like same for the iphone 8 it's this one the, but if you have a clickable home button you're going to want to hold the home button and the side button at the same time so once you click start it'll give you a countdown so side button and home button together and then keep holding the home button for 10 seconds Once your phone reboots, you're free to remove the cable from your phone and you're done. You won't need the computer anymore. Now, check ring should be installed on your iPhone. You want to click check ring and you're going to click install Cydia. Once that's finished up, guys, you can go ahead and open up your phone and Cydia will be right there. And so you want to open up Cydia. Do not click out this video yet because there's a bunch of important information that's still to be shown. So once you first launch Cydia, you'll have to do your upgrades. So you want to click changes. Click upgrade, just ignore this, but go to changes, upgrade, and confirm. And do all your upgrades in Cydia. Anyways guys, once your upgrades do install, then you're free to start installing some tweaks. Add some sources so you get more tweaks. And yeah, so I think it's going to be it for this video. Don't forget to hit thumbs up. Don't forget to comment if you have any issues. I'll try my best to respond. And once again, hit that subscribe button so I can keep posting awesome videos like this. And other that, I'll see you all in the next video.